So there's a stat on Facebook, and basically it says men are not obsessed with women like they used to be. Y'all don't find that kind of weird? And to be honest, no, I don't find that kind of weird. Because what exactly is there for men to be obsessed with in today's world? Women have left no room for imagination, none whatsoever. It's like your sense of entitlement is out of control. Your expectations are unrealistic. Y'all walk around showing your bodies half dressed, half exposed 24 seven, out smoking, drinking, partying 24 seven. A lot of these young guys see how their fathers and uncles were just tore down homeless through, through divorce, how women just completely just trash men. And they don't wanna go through that anymore. Yeah, I think it's I think it's like you said, um, a lot of men are starting to notice their self worth. Buckle up, put your seatbelt on. Here we go. Yeah, you know I'm saying peanut. I was Listen, rapping so much. Man. Here we go. Now let's let peanut get it off. It's this jump podcast. Oh. Now let's go. So there's a stat on Facebook, and basically it says. Men are not obsessed with women like they used to be. Y'all don't find that kind of weird? And to be honest, no, I don't find that kind of weird. Because what exactly is there for men to be obsessed with in today's world? Women have left no room for imagination, none whatsoever. It's like your sense of entitlement is out of control. Your expectations are unrealistic. Y'all walk around showing your bodies half dressed, half exposed 24 7, out smoking, drinking, partying 24 7, on the scene 24 7. A lot of y'all are not even coming with nothing to the table because you're too busy with your hand out trying to see what man got the next bag so he can sponsor your lifestyle to make you look like you're living a lifestyle to post on the internet. It's like a lot of y'all don't have common sense. A lot of y'all don't know how to hold a conversation. Well, she dropping a lot of y'all wow. don't have no original. Damn. Everybody is getting we the same the body. Everybody is getting I'm the dropped. same hairstyle. Everybody looks like <laughs> yeah, I need to put that on there. Like, Y'all get that confused. Oh, well, men like that. No, men will fuck that. Come on, but men now. are not wiping that and they're not cuffing that. And I think y'all are starting to realize that. And then the first thing y'all want to say is, oh, well, they're gay. They're sassy. No, they're not. <laughs> they're just tired of what you guys are presenting. <laughs> and if y'all are here to give them free pussy, free looks, and free everything they ain't got to work for, uh, why would they? <laughs> but they're never going to take you serious. So it seems to me like a lot of y'all are now starting to realize that you're either losing value or have lost value from chasing attention. And now that's something that y'all got to deal with and y'all can't face that fact. Men love women that are exclusive. Women that mm. are put up. Come women that now. every man can't say he, he had or home. can't have. Bomb. Simple as that. Yeah. You know what, man? That, 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 <laughs> man. Protect that sister. Yeah. Wherever she is, protect that sister. I'm, the, the thing is, uh, I don't want to say a lot because, I mean, we do got some of the simps out there, but a lot of a, men nowadays lot. are realizing their self-worth. Worth. I mean, because uh, men, us men, we see how society beat us. We see how the government beat us down. We see how the some of these women beat us down. How even Hollywood? Facts. There are no good men in Hollywood eyes. Shit, we can't even get a lead role in movies anymore. A lot of these, a lot of these young guys see how their fathers and uncles were just tore down homeless through through divorce how women just completely just trash men and they don't want to go through that anymore yeah i think it's i think it's like you said um a lot of men are starting to notice their self-worth so at the end of the day you know they always say like oh women will be like because i'm not trying to settle i'm not trying to settle mm -hmm. well a lot of times the men be settling because you get a woman she's combative or she's she's abusive or she has her own you know flaws or whatever and women will say stuff like oh well that's just who i am you got to accept me for who i am mm -hmm. and it's like well wow i gotta accept all the bs that you come with but me i gotta have it all together you think about it uh most women want men who i don't want to say most let me take that back a lot of women want men at their peak Oh, he has to be here. He has to have all this da 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 da. And she still want him here. And he that has to be happening. at the top. But it's like I gotta accept you when you either mid or you might be mediocre. And it's like no, I know my worth. I know that I'm I'm worth getting the right type of woman. And so mm -hmm. again, the the woman that's shown the one thing I think good women should start doing on a regular basis is number one, differentiating yourself. Stop looking like Definitely them. Stop out, going yeah. where they go. Stop doing what they do. Stop saying they, they, they their sayings. That's number one. Number two, really put it out there that no, that's not us. Because you'll see the women that you know the 
the, the Instagram women or whatever say like nah we ain't that ain't us we ain't, we ain't with that and and now you're starting to see women starting to do that like nah we ain't a part of that because it's like we don't know if y'all are not saying that this is a, not a good thing you might hear one or two women say it but if you don't see it in masses you think oh then everybody like this yeah everybody likes sexy red you think you'll think that because it's like well we're the women and now you see women like nah we ain't with that she doing too much so it's like they got to keep up that momentum so us as men we like all right we can separate the the sexy reds from the from the real women because okay, sometimes the real, the there are some gr great women out there but you dress like the hoes you acting like the hoes you listening to what the hoes listen to you go where the hoes go so it's like how do we know how we do i know, know if you a hoe or not i don't you i can't tell because you you you're mirroring the image they are so it's like just be different like she said differentiate yourself like elevate yourself yeah we want exclusive like she said men will smash men will smash anything damn near with a hole so know that and know that okay be a little bit different you don't you don't have to be all the way to the to the left or all the way to the right but just be different from what you see because most men that's what they looking for